Welcome to day 16 of my 100 days of web flow journey. Today we are going to go over how to combine or how to link two CMS collections and make them animate on hover. So basically like we see here, if we hover over day 6 or day 7, the relevant image shows here. So these are two separate CMS collections and I'm going to show you how you can combine both of them. So in our project, we have two CMS collection. One collection is collection image and one collection is the activity collection. So basically we are connecting these two elements or these two collections items by the data ID, which is slug, which is the most unique value of the collection. So this is the best value to make that um, so, you, so when I hover here, it will re, it will call that same item on here because here I also call the the data ID slug, as you can see. So, so this is how I connect both of them, and this custom code I'm gonna paste for you. You can clone this project actually, and uh, get this custom code. So, this custom code basically is saying when I hover over the the event item. A class of active will be will be coming into play. So this is what class active does. Just brings the image into play, and basically that's how the animation works. Thanks to features like this, like the attributes and how you can connect the CMS value to it, uh, you can get so many problems solved if you just try to work yourself around it. Uh, there is always uh, the help nowadays of AI that can help you with figuring out the problem or structuring out the solution to a problem that you're facing. So don't hesitate to use that. I've, I use it most of the time. I use ChatGPT to help me with issues that I run to. So in cases like this, it's always good to explore more and try new things and learn as much as possible. Thank you for watching the video. I hope I taught you something today. I'm, I'm going to share with you the link to this clonable and you can clone it. Don't forget to subscribe, like, give me a thumbs up and see you tomorrow on day 17.